communication. I feel is always the key. Not being frustrated makes sure. And Joseph Benavides has absolutely rocked Ronnie Yaya. It's over. That was an awesome shot. That's exactly what I was talking about. Here you see the hand combination from Benavides coming over the top, man. Just overhand right, clipped him right on the chin, and was very intended. Now this was the time to jump in and be inside Ronnie Yaya's guard. Here we get the just your flurry right. combination. Right on the jaw. And this is the time you want to jump in again inside of his guard is when he's stunned and hurt, and that's the proper time to approach it. Otherwise, Ronnie Yaya is just too dangerous from his back. They were telling him to really go for it once he gets on the ground. Look at that big right hand from Joseph Benavides. And he has a Rashatani hurt. And that's it. Joseph Benavides moving on. Wow, it was right, actually countered right to the kick. Never allowed Rashatani's foot to get back in place. Came with a beautiful counter right hand that caught Rashatani clean. And from there, he was relentless. Boom. It's a clean shot right on the button. Benavidez. So just the finish Joseph Benavidez was looking for as he makes a major statement here at 125 pounds. Oh, yes. Does put it together. Real nice combinations. Benavides, and he's won that one against Cejudo. But let's look at this. Boom! Oh. Right on the jaw. The fact that that didn't just put Juicy A out right. Oh, my goodness and that's gracious. How a kick should land the top of the shin on the chin. And here's the finish. He knows he's hurt. Swarms all over him. Right hook, left hand. Boom! Shot yeah. after shot. Joe is like a little pit bull in there, man. When he sees blood, he goes for it. My God. Yo, Tape and really, really cares about these guys. This is what they've needed all along. Excellent combination for Benavidez and a huge knee. Formiga's hurt. Formiga is down and he's covering up. That'll do it. Joseph Benavidez has done it again. Well, here's that work that I was talking about in the inside and then that knee. That was it. Formiga goes face down into the mat. Benavidez swarms him. So Joseph Benavidez, the biggest favorite on the card here tonight, top to bottom, closing at about a six to one favorite and showing you why. Or is, he's not worried about Darren striking. Ooh, that, hit, that hurt him, that hurt him. See the arm going yeah. out. Yeah. He's hurt, he's hurt right now. He's sucking it up. But his body is in pain right now. This could be it. 15 seconds to work for a finish right here. Oh, Sink into the pot. That's it, to the body. Joseph Benavides with vicious body shots finishes the fight. Still for three from Columbus, Ohio. Alongside Stefan Bonner, I'm Todd Harris. Glad to have you with us, fight fans. You like this one, our next fight, the main event, even better. And Benavides once again with a big takedown. Immediately going for elbows, immediately going for that pass again. And this is the speed that Joseph Benavides brings to a fight. Oh, Miguel's cut. One of those elbows cut oh, Miguel's at. Big cut, forehead of Miguel Angel Torres. He rolls around. Oh, that's a big cut. It's, it's a bad cut. The official, Mark Matheny, is looking at it closely. And if it impairs his vision, they will stop it. Once again, Benavides Torres is so in a bad good. place. So good at this team, and it's all over. Benavides with a beautiful takedown. Powerful. Lands his elbow from inside yep. the guard. And the guillotine. He gets the leg over the top. It's so hard to escape that one. Those guys at Team Alpha Male love this move. Miguel tries to roll to his back, but ultimately forced to tap. Counter left there from Benavidez. Benavidez such an awkward style. He drops his hands and throws loopy shots, throws pretty good combinations. It's hard to see him coming because of where they come from. Now as the balance thrown off, Perez went down easily there. And hammering away is Benavidez. This could be it if he doesn't move. Well, he's got to watch the back of the head there, right behind the ear. 
Whoa! Oh, just have it's, it's, whoa! You cannot do that to a fighter. You cannot step in like that and then go back in them and make them fight. Benavidez stopped because he thought the fight was over. That is deplorable roughing. And now Perez is back to his feet for the moment. And will Benavidez try to lock up a submission? And Perez taking full advantage as he should. That was a horrible job by Yves Levine. I cannot believe that. But is the right arm now under the chin as Benavidez fishes for a submission? Sorry, audio guys, I'm screaming into my mic, yeah. but that was bad. And now Benavidez has to just put that behind him and keep fighting. Still in good position, almost in a near side cradle. So a bit of adversity there, but Benavidez now hammered away once again. And will this be the stoppage? That time it's for real. Joseph Benavidez. Both of those hit the forearms of Elliott Beautiful looking for another timing. takedown. Beautiful timing there by Elliott. Ducked three for right three, under Joe. Benavidez. He is all over Benavidez. This is, this is wild. Benavidez scrambling, and Benavidez on top now, but Elliott scrambles again, trying to mount, but does not catch it. He wants to get that left leg over the right knee of Elliott. Got it. He's almost there. Man, no, he has, he has to, yep. He's not, he doesn't have it until Elliott's got his back on the mat. If Elliott doesn't have his back on the mat, if he's sideways, he's not going to catch it. Elliott really trying to prevent that move, Joe, with his leg and now his hand. So he pushed that leg away. Good control by Benavides. Yeah, Elliott wants to make sure that, that Benavides does not get his back on the mat. Elliott wants to keep that side on the mat, and he wants to keep one knee up. Now he's Got fully it. mounted. Now Elliott's in a lot of trouble. And he's cranking. And Benavides has a nasty guillotine. He also has the Looking right arm to finish trapped. his fight. That's it, he's tapping. It's all over. Out Joseph Benavides by submission. Man, that. Look this time, sprawl. both hands up the middle under the neck. He's going to go for it again. Oh, he might deep. have it. He is in deep this time on Wagby Fabiano. This is the third tight guillotine he's had this round. And how could Wagney breathe? That's he's it. tapping that out. That is All it. over. Wow. Joseph Benavides gets the submission. Here it is for the third time, Stefan. This time he doesn't have the arm in. The times before he did. And without the arm in, it's a lot easier to get the guillotine. And Wagney tried to hold off, but that is tight. Benavides got an amazing guillotine.